All righty, everyone, this is Sarah, and she just finished our three-month program, and now she's continuing with us onto our maintenance program, and she's seen so much breakthrough. But now I'll give it to you, Sarah. Sarah, tell me, mm -hmm. where were you before you started this program in your health? So I was feeling very stuck when it came to food. And when it came to um, doing exercises that were um, intentional. Mm -hmm. So I didn't know like a lot of what I know now um, because I think the knowledge behind it and the loving myself through it all too, that it wasn't just about discipline, but also how does it look like in a lifestyle that it doesn't feel heavy. Mm -hmm. um, that was very interesting. Yeah. And what are some of the strategies that you're taking now into your daily routine? What are some of the strategies we implemented? So I would say that the app helped a lot. Um, doing the meal diary, doing um, learning about macros, but that was like a whole other <laughs> new thing for me. Yeah. Um, that helped a lot to understand what my body actually needs. And one of the things that we spoke about that I wanted to achieve was to balance out my cholesterol because since mm -hmm. I was little, that was something that it was like, well, just eat lettuce or just eat um, like smaller portions. And then when I started, it was totally the opposite. It was bigger portions. Mm -hmm. I could still eat the foods that I really like and enjoy. Um, and it was more of how to balance it out. So having having those apps having like um the exercise were still small but way more purposeful um uh, way more intentional um mm -hmm. those things like helped me a lot like even today throughout this week um i saw even like some results that my mom was saying like oh my gosh you look like way more skinny and i've only lost like six pounds but like my my muscles are getting bigger. Um, I'm getting mm -hmm. toned, and when I check in in my macros, I see that it's like very balanced compared to where I was. Yeah, I was eating less, but still wasn't getting all the nutrients that I needed. Mm -hmm. um, and now I'm eating way more, way more satisfied. I enjoy it even more because I don't have to worry about it. Yeah, that's amazing. And you mentioned a little bit about your results, but what, what were some of your results internally and externally for you? Okay, so the, my main focus in the beginning was um, getting better with cholesterol because it was something since I was little, I did not know how to manage well. Mm -hmm. um, I was trying to lose 10 to 15 pounds. I was trying also to get more toned in my arms and um, so throughout the time I felt like it was very slow the process so that was a little bit like I'm a perfectionist so for me that was like oh why well, am I not like there already mm -hmm. um, but towards the end I lost uh six pounds I my cholesterol level I can actually see it there that it's very balanced in the app um, mm -hmm. My arms are way better. Um, we we used to call that back home, like with my family, we call it the alitas, like the wings. <laughs> so my wing is smaller. Your wings um, are toned. <laughs> um, and I also like you, the the areas that you mainly see the changes are in my arms and in and in my in my abs because it's way more toned. You can see those lines more defined. Um, mm -hmm. So yeah, so I really, even if I didn't hit like the, when it comes to weight, I know that I still have more muscle because I see that in the pictures. Mm -hmm. so I'm not as worried about it. Um, and even in between, like, you know, that I went through like dental procedure, a new promotion, like way, um, like big um, changes life. in my life that yeah. that were like crazy to try to do something like this make time for something like this while mm -hmm. I'm doing like those bigger changes so 
in that end, I'm, I'm very proud of myself that even through that, I was able to maintain it, even if it was in baby steps, it felt like it was possible. Yeah. And you did amazing, crushed it. And what, what would you say to someone who's sitting on the fence, kind of like you were in the beginning as to, yes. should I do this? Should I not? What mm-hmm. would you say to someone sitting on the fence doing this, pro- if they want to do this program or not? Well, for me, when, when I started, I remember that we had the conversation of like, let me wait a little bit, save up a little bit more money because it's something that I really wanted. I didn't want just to coach. I <laughs> wanted someone that could give me longevity, that I wasn't just depending on my coach for my whole life, but something that I felt like this is my life. I want to take control over this area. And I would say if, if that person, if you're in search of that, there are ways to, you know, to make um, a financial plan to making it as simple as possible and adapting it to your life, just like Mm -hmm. You did for me. Like I did not expect as much as I got because I thought that it was gonna be, oh, I gotta eat new foods all the time, or I gotta figure it out, or I gotta start from scratch. And then when I saw it was the opposite, it was very adaptable to my life. I did have like new recipes and new stuff, but they were still very simple for me to do, like in a busy week, mm-hmm. or to do them all in one day for the week to go well. Yeah. Um, so stuff like that, that was very surprising for me that I gained way more. So if, if someone is searching more than just a coach, but like the, for the long haul, what are, what are your goals and what are you really wanting? Um, if you want to something that's sustainable and enjoyable, not just pushing yourself or disciplining yourself through it, but really loving all that you are because I I like the combination of mindset Mm -hmm. but also body yeah and how the two just do a really nice connection um throughout the program I would say that this is it really hit the spot and -hmm. then it it was also like surprising that we were able to do this remotely which I thought that it was going to be like super tough yeah um because I've I've never had a coach. I've only done like online programs and stuff like that. But mm-hmm. this really felt even from a distance, it felt very personal. Mm-hmm. Because you really listened and you were very um precise to my needs in the moment and per week. Um so yeah, oh I, I would say that it was very different from any other coach that I've heard of. Love it. Love 